Hello Zavers, welcome to Z-Weave. I'm Nana and for today's video, I'm going to show you how to work with FBX Avatar imported and export animation in Alembic. Let's start. With your Z-Weave open, first I'm going to bring in FBX Avatar with walking animation that I prepared for this video. Go ahead on your property panel, click on the Avatar tab. You can see that the advanced is your default avatar, but we're going to go to Legacy to use our custom avatar. Click on Legacy. Under, you'll see folder files that says Custom. This is your avatar library where you can see your saved or custom avatars. Double click on Custom File. Now you see a plus button under it says a new avatar. Double click on plus button and this will open a window to bring an avatar file into Zwee. Direct to location where you save your avatar file and click the file and open. The icon will appear with names underneath inside your avatar library. Double click on custom avatar and now the avatar will be loaded on your 3D view. This avatar contains catwalk motion walking in place. I'm going to test play if the avatar is working well. Animation is working well. Now unsimulate the scene. Bring in dress file that I've already made. Go to files and append. Click on spring dress file and open. Patterns are all placed in avatar with fabrics. This is ready to simulate. Let's hit space and simulate. The avatar is walking well with flower dress. This is now ready to be exported. Go to files and export in Alembic. There's also an option to export your animation files in USD. Before this video, we will export this file into Alembic and finalize the look with lighting and render. With your exporting option, you can choose to export with your avatar or not, but since I'm going to apply additional hair and shoes on avatar, I'm only going to export garments. Uncheck export avatar and leave the rest boxes checked. I want to export the whole animation frame where it's draping because I want to be able to edit this point later when I'm adjusting the scene with the lighting. If you don't need your garment simulation scene, you can check on start after draping time underneath advanced option. Your files will start right when it start walking. You can also control your duration time until the end of avatar animation, or you can control your duration time by stopping simulation when you want to. And lastly, you can export number of frames you want to export by inputting exact number. Click OK and start exporting. Now the exporting is done and bring the files into the scene where you can finalize with the lighting and render views. With Siwi, with real-time simulation engine, you can easily create your animated garments with your own avatars. Hope you enjoyed this video and leave comments below if you have any questions. Thank you and see you in next video. Bye!